Hello everyone, I am Yunus. Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will discuss a small tip regarding setting budget alerts in your account. If you have started a new free tier account or if you already own one, you must ensure that you set monthly budgets for your usage. When you set a monthly budget target, you can also set up alerts at different points of that budget. For example, if you set $10 as your target expenditure for a particular month, you can set alerts at 40% point, 50% point or 80% point, so on and so forth. What it means is, when the actual expense reaches that 40% point, that is $4 if your budget is $10. So at that point, you will get a reminder email saying that your cost has exceeded the alert threshold so that you can be more cautious and control your cost. So let's begin. So to go to the budgets, either you can type budgets here or easier one is you go here and uh, click on billing dashboard and come down and under cost management you can see budgets. I have created a lot of number of budgets but let me create a new one. Assume that none of these exist. I am creating a new budget for $12. Assume my target is $12. So I will use a template or if you want to include more details etc. you can customize but I am going with a template. So for any free tier account owner, I would say zero spend budget is mandatory. What it means is even if your expense goes above 0.01 dollars, it will give you an alert saying that okay there is some charge even though it is very minute but there is some charge so it will give you an alert. So you can create a zero spend budget. Let me just do that first. So my zero spend budget may I will just mention that way. Email recipients. This is important. Just include your email. This is not my real email. I have just typed it. And then create budget. So you can see my zero spend budget may. It is created. So what will happen is if my expense exceeds 0 0.01 dollars or basically if there is even one cent charge on my account it will be triggered and I will get an email saying that there is some charge on your account. So that is about zero spend budget. If you want to see the details, you can go there. It already exceeded because my cost has already gone up. It is only 0.5 or 0.5 dollars or something. That's fine. Now let me create a, another budget. I'm not deleting it. Let me create another budget. This time I will create it for $30. So monthly cost budget, select this. Budget name, I will just say $30 budget so that easily you can identify. I will put it as $30. Email recipients, again, I will include my email. So here it says you will be notified when your actual spend reaches 85% and your actual spend reaches 100%. If your forecasted spend is expected to reach 100%. So automatically there are three notifications already activated. But you can, you can configure more notifications. We will see how. Create budget. So where is my new budget? This is the one. Okay. So I will click on that. Come down. So here you can see alerts. This is important. Click on alerts. So already you can see that actual cost greater than 85 percentage, forecasted cost greater than 100 percentage and actual cost greater than 100 percentage. There are three triggers. I want more. So what do I do? Edit alerts. So these alerts, these alerts are already existing. You can see alert 1, then alert 2, then alert 3. I want a fourth alert to be added. So what do I do? Click on add alert threshold and here instead of 80 make it 60 sorry about that 60 and again you have to give your email id you use mail at gmail.com okay and then click on next 
so you can see alert 4 which you just added okay if you want to add some action you can do that what kind of action you can say please stop the cc2 if the budget threshold is reached you can do that now i don't have any ec2s running that's why i'm not adding but otherwise you can click on add action and you can specify which ec2 instance to be stopped click on next and everything is ready just say save that's it so this is a very safe way to reduce or eliminate unnecessary unexpected charges on your credit card for your aws free tier account so please set your monthly budgets to avoid any monthly bill shocks i'll be back with another useful video soon thank you